with AM, FM, Sirius, satellite radio. Those are pretty basic. Not so basic as internet radio. You can stream as long as you have a, a, a 3G connection. Right now, I'm streaming music. A little bit of a... Uh, Right over the internet, as long as you have 3G. My music and devices, you can play any MP3 players, you can store music on the hard drive, there's going to be four USB ports and an iPod charger connector, so tons of options. Navigation system is Google Maps, you can make it full screen, it's all voice activated, you can push the voice button and say, take me home, and put in your home address, so you can find an Italian restaurant. You can use a satellite option if you, if you like that better. Energy system is really cool. You can really judge how efficiently you're driving by this. And if you do have a long distance to go, you can drive as efficiently as possible to try to make it there. It tells you how much power the motor is using, how much you're regenerating back into the battery, and how much the heating and AC system is using. Full internet capability when you're not driving. See, see the dolphins are beating the giants sure. right now. Does it tell you um, how many miles that you have left? Yes, uh, right access? up on the dash, it oh, says okay. 37 mile range. So that's how many you have left? Yes, that's how many you have left. Yeah. Okay. This car we haven't charged in a long time. So, full internet when you're not driving, because obviously it would not be very safe to do while you are driving. All the cars will come with a backup camera. Uh, the prototype doesn't have it installed, but rear view camera, uh, Bluetooth, any Bluetooth phone you can hook up, make calls, receive calls, all voice activated, stream music if you want. Is that his real number? No. <laughs> That's it. That's it. Headquarters number. <laughs> And the App Store. Uh, I'm not sure if it's going to be in it, like an Android or Apple. They haven't released any information yet, but it'll be similar where you can download all the apps you want on there. Obviously, you can do anything with those. And a cool one is the sunroof control. The sunroof is disabled on this car because they don't want to open it 5,000 times a day. But to control it, all you do is just slide that and you see exactly how far you want it back. Fully open, fully closed, or event position. And it's only this part that opens. Yeah, this, this front okay. section will slide all the way back to here. Okay. Your lights. It's really cool. Right now the lights are off, so everything's nice and bright. It's in daytime mode. You want to go to night mode and the lights turn on, everything dims down, so there it's not so there. blinding for you. <laughs> doors and locks. You can unlock and lock all your doors, open the front of your trunks, and just view the status of everything. And I'll show you really quickly if this isn't dead yet. You got a little app on here that Tesla made. I'm oh, connected cool. to this car right now. I can see what my range is. I can see where the car is located. I can open the charge port door right from my phone. To pop open yep. little location you can see right where the car is all the time you can oh, follow cool. it live as it drives down the street if you want to you can see how fast it's going if the valet has it climate control you can turn it on from wherever you are let's say it's really hot day or you want the car to be so hot when you get there and you're shopping you, you just grab this turn on the ac system 10 minutes before you get out there and the car will be nice and cool when you get there so so it's a tracker almost? yes Okay. Yep. If your car gets stolen, they're like, oh, I'll find it. Here it is. That's so cool. <laughs> wow. Or if you forget it in a parking lot. Forget it in a parking yeah. lot. Zoom in and be like, oh, it's three rows over. <laughs> so that is uh, pretty much the gist of, of all this stuff. If you guys have any tons of, room. tons of room, all the women like this to put purses and all that stuff on there. These slide back to be cup holders. Mm -hmm. Some little things like uh, storage compartments, things like that may change by the production model. Mm -hmm. This is about 90% of what the interior will be, so there may be a couple of small differences. We're going to shuffle through while well, you guys want to have a seat in the front seat. Sure. Absolutely. Yeah.